I want to be known as the greatest strongman of all time. Go in the history books with Sadrunas Savikas, Brian Shaw, Marius, all these great names. And for me to do that, I need to win the biggest and the heaviest shows in the world. I feel I need to win a big competition. You know, Arnold's is, is a huge one. And for me, it's the heaviest competition out there. It's the true heaviest competition in the world. very fortunate this year now that we've got a, a really special place to train and I think it's very well equipped now you know we've got everything there we have our log presses we have our dumbbell press we have a running track we have our stone platform and it's completely private to you know Tom myself and Harry which is amazing so to have a space like that that's the first time ever we've had a proper space that encompasses every event that we have it feels really nice just to go there so a 20 minute drive we go there with intent then we train and then it's done. We don't have to go from the gym to a warehouse and back again. always say when you take six months off or you don't love the sport but you don't hear that with footballers you don't hear that with other sportmen but 2023 is now around the corner and now I'm going to dominate come back bigger better stronger more hungrier more spicy and just ready to kind of eat up my prey you know I'm the top of the ladder people are trying to chase me and hit me down hunt, hunt me down but I'm still at the top I'm still going to keep that gold trophy still going to win the Arnolds and win everything and I Feel that? Good. Light. Spicy. And good. I feel like I'm an underdog going into these competitions. So, as an underdog coming into these competitions, no one's really speaking about me winning. For me to win that would be a huge step in the right direction to winning World Strongest Man, or at the very least, coming podium in World Strongest Man. I feel that. On a perfect day, you know, I'm not perfect all the time. In business and training and life, I'm not perfect all the time. But on a perfect day, I can win any show in the world. And that's all I need. I need one or two perfect days to complete the legacy that I'm out to create. So since Worlds 2021, my shoulder's been giving me a lot of grief. So the mobility aspect, me sleeping on it, I wake up in pain, prevents me from training to my optimal potential, I suppose. But recently, I've had the massive privilege, I guess, of getting my shoulder looked at by some top doctors down in London. Got that sorted. Tom came down with me, you know, for that moral support that, that we kind of show each other all the time. This is a specialist clinic and probably one of the best about, so he needs to come and get it checked, which is what he's done. So just going to wait and see what the results are. I'm not going into the room with him, so I'm going to have a surprise and see what... Are you a bit nervous scanter. or are you excited? Yeah, a bit nervous. I mean, it's nervous, but happy that he's actually getting it sorted for once and it's took him two years to realise that he's to get it checked. So hopefully it'll be behind him after this and we can move on, so... It's, it's stiff, yeah, it's, it's quite sore when I get up to that. And it's been in your back. <coughs> that's, that's, that's a sore right there. So at the moment it's inflamed, right. that's why you are in that pain and waking up at night time, right. all of that. Firstly, we need to calm it down the inflammation. Okay. So the way we do that is just a simple cortisone injection. Okay. But don't, don't uh, lift any. Right, okay. Yeah, just of go on. Fantastic. Yeah. You can see this slip if you want to. Mm. Okay, there we go. Hey, you're going Are you going for dinner? I don't know, there's a place next to the hotel. Where are you staying? Well done, sir. All right. Amazing. All done. All done. What's up? All done. 
That was relatively smooth. Yes. That was fine. Do so you remember we did that before? So that was that one. Yes. Do that one. You might beat me now, eh? Being able to train pain-free or relatively pain-free and not waking up in pain is, is a huge thing for me. So now that shoulder's sorted, can really push on with training with Tom and Harry. You know, we're hungrier than ever. We're back now and it's, it feels so nice to be back to full training and to have that aim on, on winning these competitions. You know, with the support from Tom, Kushi, the family, my friends, you know, we all support each other and we all support each other in that quest to become the best in the world. That's what we've learned this last few months that we've had off. We're so much better doing stuff together. If Tom needs my support, I'm there. If I need Tom's support, he's there. Is that that burger? Is there a oh, burger? Quick. <laughs> the last few months, myself, Luke and Harry have been chilling out together, eating together, training together, recovering together. It's so good that we all have the same journeys, the same ambitions and the same goal in life because we can push each other when one of us is down and it helps us just to thrive and get better every single day. For me, 2021 was an exceptional year. Tom won World's Strongest Man for the first time. I won Europe's Strongest Man. That Stoltman domination was very apparent. But 2023,